For family prayer, it's always good to read the Bible together, but you also find in the Bible prayers for you to read. Um, they're actually in of themselves prayers and we can just read them straight from the Bible. Um, and we've chosen Psalm 148 and you find quite a few in the book of Psalms. And um, this particular Psalm is about praising God. So it's good to do that as a family because God is worthy of our praise. The first few verses are about the the clouds and the, the sun and the moon and even the angels praising God. And then it goes on, um, everything on earth praising God, the plants, the animals, men, women and children. Um, and if you'd like to know more about what Psalm 148 means and um, the Bible project, um, go into it a bit more. So Peter and I are going to use Psalm 148 to pray. Um, and so we're going to read it together. And that's what you could do as a family. So let's pray. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord from the heavens. Praise him from the skies. Praise him, all his angels. Praise him, all the armies of heaven. Praise him, sun and moon. Praise him, all you twinkling stars. Praise him, skies above. Praise him, vapours high above the clouds. Let every created thing give praise to the Lord. For he issued his command and they came into being. He set them in place for ever and ever. His decree will never be revoked. Praise the Lord from the earth, creatures of the ocean depths, fire and hail, snow and clouds, wind and weather that obey him, mountains and hill, all hills, fruit trees and all cedars, wild animals and all livestock, small scurrying animals and birds, kings of the earth and all people, rulers and judges of the earth, young men and young women, old men and children, let them all praise the name of the Lord. His name is very great. His glory towers over the earth and heaven. He has made his people strong, honouring his faithful ones, people of Israel, who are close to him. Praise, praise the, the Lord. Lord. Amen. Amen.